swear I'll fix this. I guess it depends on how much you're going to spend. Whatever it takes. This woman's going to be my wife. Money's not a problem. So what's the problem then? No problem. Just my way of asking you to be my best man. Hold that thought. You know what creates great hospitality in the restaurant business? Look, I know what you're thinking. See, a lot of people don't realize that the restaurant business is split between two parts. There's the front of the house and the kitchen. The front of the house is responsible for the ambiance, greeting the guests with an inviting, pleasurable atmosphere. While the back of the house, the kitchen, creates the product, the menu, these two combined make the business. Now, who do you think is in control of that experience? That was a rhetorical question. The answer is simple. It's the server. It's the server who coordinates with the busboy to make sure that the tables get fresh bread and water. It's the server that ensures the timely delivery of the food, of the appetizer, the entree, and the dessert. And see, while all of this is going on, it's the server that ensures a pleasurable experience. He owns that experience. Now, what would happen if the waiter just checked out for an hour? The tables wouldn't get bust. The food wouldn't be delivered on time, and the guests would just leave the restaurant. See, this is why waiters get paid and get tips for exceptional service, not poor service. You see, James, you've damaged my reputation, and you've put me in a really horrible position. And just like the waiter who checked out for an hour, I now look like I have subpar employees. I now look like I have subpar service. What would happen if I fired you right now? What would your family do if I fired you right now? Better yet, what would they do if they found out why I fired you? You know what? I want you to have some fucking dignity. I'm giving you three days to make this right. Three days to fix this. Don't even think about comping a check. Walter's in the hospital. Okay, we gotta go. What do we do with him? Let him loose.